back, everybody. Uh -huh. Previously, I was going through these rivers here to get to this. Turns out that's not where I need to go. I need to be up here to go to this cave here to progress forward. Isn't that wonderful? Okay, let's go this way first. here. I don't have to worry about those right now because I can't do anything with them. Oh good, there's a gin there. Shortcut of some sort. Alright, I made it to the side. Now we're gonna go into this village here. This is where I wanted to be in the first place. Common village. And we got teepees. <laughs> the entrance is closed, you probably shouldn't go in. Alright, we're not gonna talk to me. Card reads, put 80 coins on the counter and you can stay. One of them villages. Interesting. Should be good. Okay, they raise my defense, but reduce my agility, it looks like. And then this doesn't work at all for these guys because their stuff's too strong. Uh, so 60 would be bad, I guess. 230. I don't think I do. I guess nobody's going to talk to me here. Yep. This is my house. If you look for Mopa, here I am. 
back up. Give me some room. How rude. Who have we here? Strangers in Shaman Village. What is your purpose in coming here? Shaman Village does not appreciate intruders. They're not... You're not welcome here, Outlander. Leave now and never come back. If there's something you want to say, hurry up and say it. I'll listen, but not for long. Hmm, I wonder. I have a shaman's rod, a shaman's rod here. That's the shaman's rod. Thought it lost forever. It once belonged to the great Onaba. Oh, Oba na staff was a gift from his great friend in Contigo, Yelagos. When Yelos gave it to him, Onaba accepted a great responsibility. He vowed to care for the sacred treasure of Contigo, the Hover Jade. And when the shaman rod returned to us, we are charged to give the bearer the Hover Jade. Have you outlanders come to claim the Hoover Jade? Suppose we have, yes. It's a shame you will never we will never give the Hoover Jade to you. But we brought you the shaman's rod. What's stopping you from giving us the jade? Hanabal handed the Hover Jade down from generation to generation for our care. We are to return it to the descendants of Yeglos, and you are clearly not from Contigo. That's preposterous. We returned your rod. We've come so far already. What difference does it make if we're from Contigo or not? Makes no make no mistake about it. We are the intended recipients of the stone of Yeglos. There's some way that we can get our hands on the hover jade? No, you have what you asked the impossible. What about the test? Would that be a bad idea, Mapa? You know, the trial road. Only Yeglus could walk that path. The way of the vanishing sand. Yes, if you outlanders intend to claim the hover jade, you must fetch fetch it and bring it here. If your people have the courage, follow me. Ah. Uh, you told me... If you told us that there was a test to begin with, we would have been out of your hair by now. What kind of test is this? I understand that you're a little concerned, but unless you try it, you'll never know. Give it our best. As I sneak into his house. I'm not even going to talk to anyone right now. I'm just going to go downstairs. I want to do this. Well, first I want to do this. side let's do that hmm. Hmm. okay I can't do it then let's just go the stone of Yeglos, you must cause this sand to disappear. If you can manage that feat, then the blood of Contigo runs through your veins. Mm, I wonder what I have to do here. You can do it, Chiba. Leave it to me, Jenna. This will be a breeze. Ha ha ha. I mean, I totally already did this at uh, Air's Rock.
I don't believe it. They did it. The sand vanished. Legends are all true. He's the one. She must have come from Contigo. Her? She's the only one that did it. But she is just a girl. And you wanted the sand to vanish, so... We have the hover jade now. Nope. You still can't have it. Why not? It was just a test to see if you earn the right to take the test to earn the stone. There's more than they have to do before you give it to them the stone. They will have to reach the end of the trial road. The girls too, surely you cannot make them. I only thought the chosen hero could travel the road. What are you saying, I can't be the chosen hero? Heroes have always been men ever since the time of Hona... Hona... Hubana. It is the way. I don't like your attitude, mister. I can be every bit as heroic as some guy. That might be true, but you must respect our customs. It's the same in Contigo, you know. If you don't like it, take it up with Yegos. Hold it, hold it, Mappa. What are you just try? What are you... What were you just saying about Trial Road? We reach the end of the Trial Road. Won't our names join the ranks of your heroes? Raiden's right. It shouldn't matter at all if a girl does it. All that matters is that we finish. If you give us a chance, we'll prove it to you. Unless you're afraid that a girl might become your town's newest hero. They have earned the right. Shall we let them into the trial? I don't like the way these outsiders were talking to me. I think they need to learn exactly what it takes to be a hero around here. Yeah, if these guys are so stubborn, let's give them a shot. They'll probably give up. You said it yourself. We're too stubborn to quit. Yeah, if you want us outlanders to leave, you better give us the chance to walk Trial Road. Trial Road is a difficult one. When you reach the top, a terrible battle awaits you. Difficult enough for me. I expect you will find it quite impossible. Still interested? Yes. Seems You seem confident, but it is your ignorance speaking. Let's go this way just briefly. Nope, can't go that way. Listen carefully to me. Gay provides you with an opportunity to practice your skills. Legend says the Yeglos and Honoba once fought here. These columns commemorate this. They reach, they raced one another to the summit. And they fought with all their might on the peak of the mountain. In honor of their great battle, the leaders of Shaman created this trial. The rules are simple. The room is filled with traps and snares. Use the power of Contigo to avoid them. The road has four doors. To open them, you will need to place items in these chests. Why? door is triggered only when a treasure chest are filled with the correct weight. Putting the heavier items like weapons and tools into the chest or the doors won't open. If you reach the door after your opponent do, you will have a serious disadvantage. You see, it will take twice the weight to open the door. Down on the switch and the number of chests you need will, will fill will open. If you are the last to each of the four doors, you will lose eight items to the chest. Trial proves too much for you. Press this button. Ends the battle, though. A true hero would not surrender so easily. In order to reach the, ba reach the battle at the summit, you cannot fail on Trial Road. You understand, yes. You understand the treacherous path of Trial Road. Will you continue? Yes. Heard the rules and you wish to continue. You have been warned. Choose the road of your liking, it matters not to us. I'm gonna go this way. That's a hard nut.
you have chosen, we shall take the other path. On the count of three, the challenge begins.
Yeah, so the game just skips straight to here. You are swift. You may prove a challenge yet. However, just because you're fast does not mean you're strong. Challenge or no, I will win. Let the battle begin. Right, so we've got knight and knight and the guy in the center. Uh, we're only at a slight disadvantage. So we're going to hopefully focus on these outside guys here. power here. Very unfortunate. Alright, so looks like I'm gonna have to use healing. Increase all the time. Paralyze, raise agility, counterattack. Let's do this. up pretty good here. Yeah, that's going to be a problem if that keeps happening. Well, let's take a look here. What do we got to summon? We've got Eclipse. Oh, I need one more water to do Eclipse. Let's do that. Oh no, I need one more wind to do that. Defenses. Oh, I wish you were dead. Let's see. We'll use Eclipse. You're dead now. All right, this will protect me at least for a round. So this is what a clip. Eclipse looks like. It's a giant dragon. He's gonna shoot a big beam at me. Except he's not gonna be anything to get them. Pretty amazing, huh? A little bit of recycled animation there. Jeez. Nope, can do that on 
you you are going to paralyze agility revive prove useful but I can't do anything with that. So let's do that and we'll do it on you. Alright, we will summon Barrialis like that. Sealed. Great. I don't have anything to heal with. Oh, I have Meteor to summon. Okay. This should give me the ability to use Wooden Cure on myself. Fly well on yourself. Big damage. Alright, full life for me. Full life for Pierre's. And I need to summon another one here. heal with my 230 some damage. Yeah! He's dead. You guys suck. Alright, alright. You've proven your strength and you are heroes indeed. As promised, you will receive the Hover Jade and we will take the Shaman's Rod. Yay. After many years, the vow that Honaba made to Yelgos has at last been fulfilled. I am tired now. I'll be... Back in the shaman's village, resting. I'm sure, you must be exhausted as well. Let us go back to the village and rest. All right, we get to stay in the bed. First things first. Up, oh, healed me all the way up. Good job. This village should now be hopefully open to me now. Hopefully they'll talk to me as well. Very proud of Mappa here. He is a great leader. If anyone in town says something mean to you, please forgive them. Round your people like a nice hot steak and some potatoes and beans. You foreigners might be used to strange exotic food, but we like our meals simple. Simmering soup is made with broth of cow bones. Seems like a traditional shaman meal passed down from generation to generation. I've been inside for so long, I think I have a little pan, a little picnic. But what should I eat? I've been locked up inside all day. So glad to get outside and stretch. Alright, I guess we'll just get the fuck out of here. Except we're not. We're gonna go in here. 